One of the things though that, that we really have to be careful of is that as blue ghost popularity has increased and more and more people want to see them, they're concentrating their, their attention, people's attention is being concentrated into a few areas and that's actually damaging the population in those areas. The blue ghosts are known from DuPont State Forest, but that's not the only place they occur. And in fact, what's happened is that they're being loved to death in, blue, in uh, DuPont State Forest because so many people are concentrating into one area and they're, they're trampling through the forest, they've got their dogs, they've got strollers, they've got a lot of people, and those females are on the ground. They come out for a short period to mate with a male and it would be so easy for someone to step on them without knowing that they were and then damaging that population. So DuPont is restricting the number of um, visitors that can come in during blue ghost season so that they're trying to protect that habitat and protect that population. Uh, they're, just, they're just too many people concentrating in too small of an area. So what I encourage people to do, um, I want people to get out and enjoy the natural world and I want them to see blue ghosts because they're just such a fabulous phenomenon. But really the way to see them, the way to have an experience of blue ghost is to go out into the forest and stay there overnight. Go camping somewhere, find yourself a spot and sit for hours in quiet without a lot of other people around and enjoy what you're seeing in nature.